guys, this is Kelly with Spada Home Madrid, and today I'm going to show you a really beautiful five bedroom apartment in La Plaza de Matute. So, this is very close to the Anton Martin metro station. We're also not that far from the Atocha train station. Um, this is a really cool neighborhood to live in, so let's check it out. So, this is the entrance right here. Um, you can see we have a furry friend, so this is the cat. He lives here, so you must like cats if you're gonna live here too. Um, this apartment is shared with a live-in landlord, so it's a recently retired couple, and they have um, pretty much the first part of the house is all private, so this is like their private living room, and they have these rooms, and then they rent two of the bedrooms, so we're going to see those two bedrooms today. Um, so this would be shared space, this is the entrance, and if you happen to like piano, you have a beautiful piano here that you can practice on. Um, so this is private living room, dining room area. And then we come down this hallway. Um, this is a private bedroom, private bathroom, another bedroom. And then here is the section where the two bedrooms for rent are. So this is another entrance to the house. Um, this is the, sh so there's three bathrooms in total. This one is the one that's shared between the two rooms that are for rent. So I'll show you this one. So you can see it's a full bathroom. Here's the sink and the toilet. This is the mirror, um, the bathtub right here, and shower. Okay. And then this is bedroom number one. So you can see one thing I love, we have these really tall, beautiful ceilings in here. You can see here's a bookshelf. We have these beautiful radiators and it is central heating. Um, here's a big desk and a chair. There's a single bed, a dresser right here. And then you have this wardrobe, and you can see there's really big ceilings. There's another heating and air conditioning unit. So in the wardrobe, your storage space would be this first part, and then the landlady um, keeps some storage things up there that are hers. And then you would also have um, this side, which is the same. So you'd have like these drawers in this part, and then up there that would be, that would stay there. Um, this is an interior window, but you still have this beautiful, like, door. Okay, cool. So this is bedroom number one. And now we're going to continue down the hallway. This is another private bathroom, uh, a private office, and this is bedroom number two. So bedroom number two has a single bed. You can see there's a radiator over there as well. This is an interior um, window looking into this interior patio. And then here we have a desk and a chair, a bookshelf, and you also have these um, built-in wardrobes here. So this is the storage space you'd have, um, as well as on this side, you can see there's some shelves. Okay, now we're going to go into the kitchen. So here's the kitchen. Um, this is a shared space, and you can see it's fully equipped. We have this table, another radiator. Um, there's a washing machine and a dryer, although the landlady prefers really not to use the dryer. Um, we have this big refrigerator right here. There's an oven and microwave. This is the stove and the sink. Okay, and there's also air conditioning in here. And yeah, so that's about it. You can see this long hallway back to the front entrance. I'll just walk down there so we can see one more time. The layout, and here we have our cat friend, Lowney. <laughs> so I think we'll end it there. For Spada Home, this is Kelly, and we hope to see you soon. Bye!